Hey guys, it's Sandy. Welcome back to Cute Polish. Both Aaron and I are huge Disney fans, and with the upcoming release of the new Disney Pixar's Toy Story 4 movie, we thought it would be fun to show you guys a cute manicure inspired by this fantastic movie series. Hey guys, it's Erin. So I'm starting off with a base coat on all of my nails. The first character I'm going to do is Forky, who's the new character in Toy Story. So I'm going to be painting this nail white. Then I'm taking a dotting tool and a gray nail polish and adding two different sized dots for the base of his eyes. Now with a small brush and some red acrylic paint, I'm painting a curved line above those two dots. And I'm going back in with another dotting tool and a white nail polish and adding a white dot over the gray dots I did before and then adding black dots on top of that. These should be two different sizes because his eyes are two different sizes. Now I'm taking a small brush and a blue nail polish and I'm painting his mouth. The next character I'm going to be doing is Bo Peep, so I'm starting off by painting my nail this light blue periwinkle color. Then with a light pink nail polish, I'm creating a line along the bottom of my nail. Now I'm taking a thin brush and a white nail polish and painting two lines coming together at the bottom in a V shape. Then in between those two lines, I'm painting small curved C shapes to create a scalloped pattern like the one on her blouse. Then with a dotting tool, I'm adding details to the lace along the side by creating a row of dots up each side of the white lines. The next nail is for Buzz Lightyear, so I'm starting off with a white base. Then I'm taking a mint green nail polish and painting about the top one third of my nail with that green. And I'm kind of creating two rounded trapezoid shapes here to match the shape of the top of his outfit. Then I'm taking this dark purple and painting a line coming down from each side of the green. Now to add the details to Buzz's outfit, I'm putting a red dot on the right side and then three lines on the left side. They should be blue, green, and red. And the last little detail on his spacesuit is a yellow line above the red dot. For my next nail, I'm going to be doing it inspired by Jesse. So again, I'm starting with a white base. Then I'm taking a yellow nail polish and again painting about the top third of my nail with that yellow. Once I have a big enough block of yellow, I'm using my brush to create two pointed edges coming down from that big rectangle just to kind of create the details of the top of her blouse. Now I'm going in with a thin brush and red acrylic paint to outline that yellow shape. And Jessie kind of has this curvy line on the yellow part of her shirt, so I'm trying to recreate that here with the red acrylic paint. Now with a dotting tool and a light gray nail polish, I'm putting two dots down the white part of my nail for the buttons of her shirt. Then once those are dry, I'm going in with the white dot on top of that. And the last nail is, of course, inspired by Woody, so I'm starting off with a yellow base on this nail. Then I'm taking my thin brush and red acrylic paint to create the stripes on his shirt. 
One great thing about using acrylic paint for this is that if you mess up your lines at all, you can just scrape off any mistakes with a toothpick. Now I'm taking a white nail polish and creating the vest that Woody wears. So for this shape, I'm really just creating a white block on each side of my nail, and then towards the bottom, I'm rounding it off as if it's the bottom of the vest. Now I'm going in with that light gray nail polish again to create the base of his buttons. And while those are drying, I'm going back in with a black acrylic paint and outlining that white shape from before. And again, any mistakes with acrylic paint, you can just scrape off with a toothpick. Now I'm adding a smaller white dot on top of each of those gray dots. And with another dotting tool, I'm creating the cow print on Woody's vest. Finally, apply a top coat to all your nails to seal in your design and add a beautiful shine. Now for the woody nail, you can stop here if you'd like, but I had a little star stud that I thought would be perfect for his sheriff's badge. So I'm applying a dot of nail glue here and then applying that stud right on top. And that's the finished design. Be sure to let us know in the comments below if you liked this nail art and who your favorite Toy Story character is. You can click the boxes here to check out more videos from Cute Polish and subscribe to Cute Polish by clicking the circle on the left for a new video every week. You can also subscribe to my personal nail channel by clicking the circle here.